Marshall in the middle. One of the things that I, I was proud of in the Army was that I could back up anything. Right, I grew up at the lake. I grew up backing trailers down. That's what I wanted to do as a kid. I wanted to be old enough I could help back the trailer in. And so, but when I got in the army, they were like, "You can back." I'm like, "Yeah, I'm back." Ain't everybody back? I'm like, man. Next thing I know, I was backing everybody's stuff around. It's good to be the private that can do things like that. Special. All the privates that couldn't do anything was on KP detail. That was me. He <laughs> was on KP detail. <laughs> I broke a record. <laughs> you broke a record. <laughs> the most, the most KP duties done with the least amount of potatoes there peeled. <laughs> no, they didn't count the potatoes. They just uh, this counted the days of KP. <laughs> There was, there was eight of us from the same guard unit that went through at the same time. <laughs> During the 4th of 71, we left the Dauphin Airport, headed to Newark, New Jersey. We got off the plane, we were bused to, uh, of course we, we had a flight change in Atlanta. <laughs> but uh, when we got to Newark, we were bused from there to Fort Dix, New Jersey. And uh, we stayed in a, we had a week of reception where we gathered our gear and got a little familiarized with the military. And then the real school started. Right. Welcome to the real military world. Mm -hmm. uh, we, uh, when we got to the brick barracks, we were in the old wooden barracks, like the World War II barracks to start with. And uh, they shipped us over, put us on cattle trucks, and shipped us over to the uh, brick barracks and divided us up in the platoons company. And uh, they asked for volunteers. They needed eight KPs to volunteer. There was eight of us. And they said, if you volunteer now, you'll be pulled off any future list and uh, a couple of my buddies came up and said uh, we're all going to volunteer we need you to join in with us we need eight there's eight of us so, uh, they said you're the only one that doesn't, want to, doesn't agree to this I said I'm sorry I said the only advice I was given from anyone and I got the same advice from several is don't volunteer for anything and I said, no, I don't, I'm not volunteering. Come on, Lee, you got to help us. You you know, you'd be the only one we'll have our aid. We can stay as a group. Okay. I volunteered. Within within two or three days, my, my name came up on the KP list. And I went to the sergeant. I told my buddy that asked me to volunteer. I said, okay, I got KP again. That's just not right. Let's let's go see the sergeant about it. I went to the sergeant. He and I went to the sergeant. I said, uh, "Hey, uh, my name's on the KP list." I said, uh, "We volunteered the other day, and y'all said y'all would keep a list of it. And we'd be uh, we'd have ours behind us already." He looked at me, and smiled. He says, "You know, I think this got lost." <laughs> <laughs> you know, I think that we got lost. I believe that miss got lost. Okay. <laughs> I pulled KP maybe four times, five times. Right. You know, in nine weeks. Uh, the last time I pulled it, we were we were within a day or two of being out of there. It might have been. It might have been our last day there. And when I walked in that kitchen, the cook looked up. They said, Lee, are you back again? I said, yep, you got me again. One of the cooks walked over and he says, look, he said, you know this kitchen as well as we do. 
You've been here enough. You know what's got to be done. He said, yeah, I do. He said, you're in charge of the KPs today. You don't have to do anything. You just pick the KPs and make sure they do their job, and we won't have to be hassled with them. It'll take a load off us, and it'll lighten your load. I said, I got you covered. So about that time, one of them came up and said, could John and I be DROs? I said, yeah. Yeah, y'all got that. The other one said, I'd like to have pots and pans. I said, you got pots and pans. The other one says, I want to be outside where I can smoke. Can I have the garbage can detail? I said, your own garbage can. Everybody got to do what they wanted to do. I walked around the, that day, just fished. <laughs> it, was, it was the... Marshall in the middle.